I just grew up in a small town where everybody kind of knew everybody. And for aviation, I was kind of limited on uh, where I could choose from. But um, I had a couple friends that was going here too as well. And uh, that's kind of what drove me to make that decision. I've always kind of had a little interest in it, in planes and um, that type of field. So when I got here, it was a, kind of a, I wouldn't say like a leap of faith, but it was somewhere around that. Um, so I just started and then kind of stuck with and I've enjoyed it ever since. For aviation, it's all about building hours. And once you get so many hours, you can move on to bigger things. Um, what most of, most of the students do at Quincy Aviation is uh, they become flight instructors for it. And uh, I think that's what I'm going to do for a few years, kind of to build my hours, but also give back to the school in a sense of by teaching um, their new pilots as well. Well, I found out about the scholarship through uh, uh, my I guess would be my high school advisor and Quincy's uh, advisor. They send me emails of lists of you know scholarships that may apply to uh, me. So on one day I just sat down and went through these scholarships and found that uh, this one pertained to me. What it's meant to me, uh, it's helped me uh, prolong my uh, aviation career. So essentially, um, I can get it done much quicker and what I intended it to do. So it's a four year program here, but instead I've uh, doubled up on classes and I'm getting to the point where I can graduate early, a year early. I think it's uh, really important to, a, especially a college student who has to, have, it has, they have stress of dealing with, you know, not only the homework, but trying to find uh, ways to be able to pay for that college as well. Then on top of that, they have to work one to two jobs just to make sure they can stay enrolled. Just relieving, you know, some of that pressure uh, goes a long way for students.